Watch you guys, got another video here for you. Now if you're like me, I do actually like the Windows 8 operating system, but there's a couple of little flaws with it which I don't like, and one of them is this Metro interface here. I don't like the actual Metro interface at all on my desktop, and I'd love to disable it. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do that with a nifty little program. You can also disable the chimes bar here, which is on the uh, right hand side. And with this little program, you can also disable the little icon down in the uh, bottom left hand side here the app switcher and stuff like that you can disable all those and I'll show you how to do that in this video so let's go to the desktop now this is a Windows 8.0 machine but it also works on Windows 8.1 now the program we're going to be using is called skip Metro Suite we're going to use that one and inside here there is these two little folders one called uh, Windows 8 times 86 and Windows 8 times 64 64 is for 64 bit, 86 is for 32 bit. So we're going to be using the 32 bit version here. Now, as you can see here, down in the bottom left hand corner, if we want to disable this little uh, icon here, we can do that. So we can't open the Metro interface. And we can also disable this chimes bar and also the Metro interface itself. So let's open up the folder and I'm going to run this as administrator. And this is the actual program itself. As you can see here, we've got the little ticks for the boxes here. We can put those in to enable skip Metro Suite. And we can do that here by putting a little tick in there. And it also gives us some other options to uh, skip the start screen as well. If you wish, you can put that on. And also underneath here, we've got our little hot corners, which actually removes the chimes bar and the start button and also the app switcher and stuff like that. You can disable all this if you wish, okay? And all you need to do is put ticks in them like so. Now, if once that's done, you can save your settings and you're pretty much good to go from there. Okay, so I quickly installed my start button here and I'm just gonna quickly restart the system and then we'll see what it looks like then. Let's reboot our system to see if the Metro interface comes up. And there we have our login straight into the desktop, no Metro interface as you can see, completely disabled. And the chimes bar is now all gone as you can see if I hover down the bottom right hand side or the top right hand side and come down to the bottom left hand side. I've also put in my little start button here so now I've got my system back to the way I like it. It's exactly how it would be if I was running a Windows 7 machine, but this is Windows 8 and it runs nice and fast and I've got it looking back the way I wanted it. So that's basically how you disable the Metro interface in a Windows 8 machine or 8.1. And a big thank you to the guy that created this program because it's awesome and it works a treat. So with that, I'm going to end this video. So thanks again for watching. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoyed the videos, hit the like button, guys. It really does help me out. And also hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos and it will keep you up to date for when I upload new videos. Okay, so have a great weekend, guys, and I'll still see you again in the next video. The link will be in the description for the program. Thanks again. Bye for now.